Welcome to another episode of Five Star Layover. Today we're going to a New York inspired island, Cinnabar, which is co owned by a couple, Amy and Alec. Amy and Alec are both very involved with island development, so I'm very interested to see how they can collaborate on island design while still express their different personality at the same time. Hi, Amy. Hi, Rachel. How's it going? Good. Good to be on Cinnabar. Yep. Let's go around. Yeah, so um, we named our island Cinnabar, which is after an island in Pokemon. Mm. And the island has nothing to do with Pokemon. Oh. But our island is actually themed after New York and mm. started off the tour in West Village. Awesome. Um, you can see on your left is a little art gallery. Ooh, are they are they real art? Fake art? Some of them are real and some are fake. <laughs> There's nice. a nice pot as well. <laughs> Cute. Very artsy, artistic, like New York. <laughs> yep, and you can see our little skyline over here. Oh, nice. Ooh, how can you get the simple panel to be so so high? There's a cliff back here. Ah, that's so clever. Nice. Yeah, I looked at it. <laughs> Want to talk about this construction? No, I'll save it for the other one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's elsewhere. Yeah. So I like the trash here too. Very oh, yeah, authentic. It's very realistic. <laughs> <laughs> nice. You might notice we littered our town with schooners. Mm. That's actually inspired by San Francisco, since I don't right. think scooters have here yet. I don't think they are. Yeah. You'll see a few of these around. Nice. Lime scooters. <laughs> and this is, would you say this is Union Square? Washington Square Park. Okay, this is Washington Square Park. Oh. Signature quest. Oh, yes. But then there's like street uh, artist corner with some music sheet or something. Yeah. We had to flesh out this little jazz musician thing I was trying to start here, but never <laughs> finished. <laughs> nice, nice. We got the uh, point across. Yep, and uh, now we're heading into like proper downtown. There's a lot of shops here. Mm, my favorite. Is this a bar or an arcade? Uh, it was a bar as soon as I could find a counter for it, but it's a, for now it's an arcade. Yeah. Mm. It's a back room. Nice. So, pretty much all of our stores and stuff are right around here. Okay. So we're gonna come Ooh. up with the next big skyscraper. Wow! Mm -hmm. You got Able Sisters, and then what is this, Alec? Uh, what is, is this monstrosity? <laughs> it's under construction, but any any good midtown would have the Empire State Building. Oh, any, yes. <laughs> wow. I need to get a blue lighthouse for the top to make it like one story taller. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, Empire State under construction still. Yep. Mm -hmm. You see the little construction sign at the top? I noticed. <laughs> Amazing. And here's our little bookstore. Ooh! Yay. Very small, like everything in Manhattan. Oh. Uh, oh, the Strength bookstore is humongous. Wow. That's true. <laughs> Maybe we'll expand this a bit more. Yeah. How oh, nice. I want to go back to court over here for a yeah. little pickup game. Yeah. Only one, yeah. only one person lives on the upper east side. <laughs> of course. This is our museum. It's still a little bit under construction. We've got the uh, space and insect wing on the right and the um. chicken wing on the left. Oh, yeah, it's like that um, very elaborate Egyptian collection in the, in the Met. Yeah. Nice. I don't know if there's any more Egyptian objects that we need to collect. I don't remember. Yeah. Mm. I think even these lions are kind of uh, inspired by the Met. I knew your public library. Oh, yeah. 
Uh, my little project is a botanical garden with one of every type of flower I've spread so far. Nice! It's like a catalog. That okay. looks cool. Um, well, that's um, impressive. I didn't put any of the wind flowers yet because there's no room. Mm. <laughs> Maybe we'll have to rearrange this. Okay. That's cute. And five star island. Simple. Yeah. Lilia. Mm. Oh, there's a little plant shop, so cute! Oh, this is my favorite part over here. We've got a little plant shop. Mm. That one's inspired by our downstairs neighbor. Yeah, our downstairs neighbor, Michael, owns the plant shop. Nice! And this is a little pizza store. Oh, of course! Pizza. Oh, true New Yorker now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so cute! We're coming up on Alex's house. The lobby's pretty nice. Oh, the lobby's okay. Wow! It is so different from last time when I saw that it was a barn. Yeah. <laughs> That's so, this is so grand. It's like a hotel lobby. Yeah. Nice. The antique little table and furniture. By the way, I like your dress. Is this? Did you make make this? No, it's from the store. Oh really? Got a little. Oh, uh, up here. Very oh, fitting for. <laughs> very fitting for uh, Alex music loving. It's an underground club. Yeah. Is this your <laughs> ideal? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Feels <laughs> appropriate. Nice. East. East, Amy. <laughs> I, I like the kitchen. I think it turned out pretty nice. It has a really good dark theme to it. Nice. Yeah, yeah. I like it. Yeah. And the island is so nice. It's like fits with the rest of the dark theme. <laughs> You got yeah. your Zoji Rushi. Yeah, we got the Zoji Rushi is a must. <laughs> I, I feel don't... ashamed I don't have one of those in real life. You want a Zoji Rushi in real life? <laughs> yeah. We, we just upgraded to one and let me tell you, the it's game changer. It. Really? Okay, that's good to know. Maybe I will upgrade now. Awesome! This is cute. I like the little red. Um, Imperial stuff? Imperial stuff on the wall, too. I think that's all that we're seeing in my house. The rest is still mm -hmm. on the construction. Um, okay. So we finished Alex's house. Mm -hmm. This is the um, statue of Liberty here. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to switch you to this back alley. Haha, <laughs> nice. The leaf. Oh! Little, uh, Cute. Statue of Liberty viewing area. <laughs> so it's like a Staten Island or something. <laughs> I like it. This is yeah, so it's cute. It's supposed to be like Battery Park, but it's just in the wrong part of Manhattan. But it's the only place you can put the statue. Yeah, yeah, I feel like when we got the statue from Gulliver, that's when we knew we were going to theme our island. Nice. Of course. Got your little personal fruit orchard here. <laughs> One of very, fruit. very compact. <laughs> um, do you want to go to Brooklyn or Queens next? I guess Brooklyn. Okay, we can head to Brooklyn. I don't awesome. Like Queens has the school, which I think is cute. It doesn't not all both Manhattan. I feel is pretty well done. The two uh, other boroughs need some work. Did you position them according to the real? We started position. that way, but they're not. All no. Way. Just... So what is this, Alex? Uh, Coney Island. Yep. Coney Island. Mm. <laughs> a little bit uh, cold today for shaved ice, but we got shaved. Mm. What's the weather in New York right now? Is it really hot? Yeah, it's 85. Yeah, it's really hot. You need to get out of this house. Oh, this street organ is so cute, this pattern. 
There's a little bit of a fishing area and uh, a super out of place shell table. <laughs> yeah, this is a little design, but this is definitely not well designed yet. Yeah, when we were trying to get five stars, I put down a bunch of random words on the side. Yeah. Put down this road and take a deep oh. breath and get <laughs> nice. Yep. I saw that you moved the car over here. Cute. Oh, I want more time. And do like a Lincoln Tunnel here. <laughs> so that's good. Yeah. Um, not sure what to do with this space. Nice. The other part. Mm hmm. That's cute. I like the. I saw a lot of people, yeah, a lot of people make Japanese gardens. I kind of want to make one of those. Is there a Japanese style garden in New York? Is there? Not. There's probably a small one in Central Park. Yeah. Mm. And then there might be one in the Bronx Botanical Gardens. Yes. You need to go to that. But this is like the second little neighborhood mm. that we have in Brooklyn. Nice. The brownstones. <laughs> well, I guess these are the brownstones. Lots of unkempt flowers here that I have to deal with. <laughs> Alex is bad because he thinks our island is overrun with flowers. <laughs> well, Alex uh, did criticize my island for having too many flowers <laughs> last time he came. So wow. at least it's consistent. Flowers are an invasive species. I like <laughs> Oh, I love the clothing line, kind of. Uh, it feels very living. Yep. So we're gonna hop over to the right. Here. Okay. Let's go park. Yay! So this is Central Park. We've got the little viewing area for the awesome. sweats. <laughs> nice. I'm also proud of this garden. I like it. That's cute. Yeah, strawberry field. Nice. Oh, there's a little path and everything. And a lot of little paths, um, just like Central Park. We got our mm. oh, the oh. library. Nice. Yes, open, the open air library. All and the benches. Oh, yeah, some park amenities. You could probably add more things to Central Park. It's not much to do much. But I like how it's sort of natural looking. Yeah. And there's waterfalls too. Yeah. Uh, do you want to head up or east? Um, let's head east and then up. Because there's not as much stuff in the top. So east of Central Park. This makes no sense at all, but this is clean. <laughs> Um, up here, there's not much development yet. We just have um, mm. a lot of flower storage and one villager who lives here. Mm. This is probably going to become flushing. Yay! Some street food, Chinese yeah. restaurants. Tango. But yeah, this is where I bred a lot of flowers, so they're all still here. That makes sense. You need the space to breed flowers. What flowers are you breeding right now? Uh, the ones that I really want are green mums and purple tulips, but I haven't mm. set up a purple tulip area yet. Mm. You want to talk about the little stuff down here? Yeah, yeah. sure. So this is kind of uh, kind of inspired by like the school, like the, all the PS, uh, public school systems in New York. So we just need to put at least one in. Mm. Uh, this little classroom. I figured Queens would be a good location for it. Mm. Oh. Soccer field was one goal. Yes. <laughs> I mean, New York <laughs> I like that there are different things on the tables. It's like different subjects uh, of study. What? Um, is there anything in the South that we need to talk about? 
our campsite is down here, but that's pretty much it. There's like a campsite and a few campsite amenities. So this will be Rockaway Beach, I guess. Yeah. Mm. We just went to Long Beach last weekend, so maybe. Mm. How was it? It was really nice. Um, there were a lot of people there, but it wasn't too cloudy. So I guess we can head north of Central Park now. That's where my house is. Yeah. The one other person who lives up there with me. Oh, is that your favorite villager? No, we just thought it would be cute if like um, most people lived in some central neighborhood and then one or two villagers mm. would figure out. More secluded. Yeah. It's so this is my house. Alex and the terraforming is very extra. <laughs> it's very <laughs> symmetrical. <laughs> Nice. It's and cute. actually, all the flower breeding was so that I could fill up this area with pink flowers. This is so good. <laughs> it's like different shades of pink. Yep. Um, it looks really good. Did you call it extra racial? Is that maybe the adjective you use? <laughs> no. It's cute little cottage, you know, like it's like a little hideaway uh, among the waterfalls. Let's yeah. visit your house. I think it's like in the cat skills, you know? Okay. We don't nice. have to do all of them because I haven't decorated my house that much. So, yeah, this is my living room. Um, I kind of collect cute furniture, but I have like a, all different colors of cute furniture so they don't look very good together. That's so cute. So, sofa. Whoa. Thanks. Uh, it's really rare to see the yellow. Like, I always get the pink uh, cute furniture. I've never seen the yellow. Actually. I didn't realize there were so many colors. I want yeah. pink, but I got yellow and blue. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, let's go to the kitchen. Okay. And we're not going to go to the basement because that's really ugly. I set up the basement to be like feng shui optimized and it's right. really ugly. <laughs> <laughs> it's like red on the right. Uh, like that. Oh, it's so cute. It's like an apple room. Apple themed. It's an apple themed kitchen. Nice. Uh, also got a little zoji mushi. <laughs> I like it's the same color as Alex. <laughs> cute. Okay. Let me see your uh, fridge. Ah! <laughs> I went over. What's inside? There's an outfit called Bun. <laughs> <laughs> Cute. I can put it on. <laughs> Amazing. Is one of the rapids is your favorite, one of your favorite um, villagers, right? Yeah, uh, Dadi is my favorite villager. Mm. So on the left we have the staff. Also haven't updated this in a while, but I like it. I like think there's too much bamboo in my bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> it has all the necessities of the shower. Mm. A little uh powder room area nice i like the partition <laughs> and of course you need the tankless uh, toilet tankless toilet <laughs> mm. feels very zen with the bamboo yeah. hey yeah. you didn't use a bamboo floor so it's not all bamboo yeah maybe i should use it Floor that would look better. <laughs> but I feel like in a bathroom, you need a tile floor. Yeah, yeah. It's better. With water drainage. Yeah. Oh, and then that rock is so cute. Is that a store box? The, the one here? Uh, no, like uh, near the toilet. That's nice. I like the shower too. Yeah, me too. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <constant> <laughs> shower. 
Yeah. I really want to put all my flower furniture together somewhere. Mm. I guess there's like the pansy table and there's the rosebud. What else? Lily um, player. In the back is my bedroom. I have it. This is like how I decorated my one room, my original one room. Mm. I guess I did put up a white chocolate wall. Mm -hmm. It's so cute. <laughs> Love the peach rug with the peach chair. Um, <laughs> the humidifier is my favorite. <laughs> Nice. I like how you like block this area with the with the coffee mug. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a sacred uh, area. <laughs> I was so excited at the beginning when I bought the Animal Crossing themed Switch. It was like the first expensive item that I bought in the game. True. How much is it? It's like thirty-five thousand. Yeah, really expensive. A lot more expensive than the regular one, which is already expensive. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's in real life now. I don't know. Do you have an office too? I have an office upstairs. Thanks. I want to turn it into a library though. It's a work in progress. Mm -hmm. This is my oh. half library, half office. It's so good. It's very weird decoration because I put all my antique furniture in here. <laughs> mm. well, that's nice. You know, like an old library study sort of thing. Yep, got the typewriter and the desktop computer. <laughs> Need the old and the new. I learned that you can like customize the desktop scene. It's so exciting. Oh, I also really like this rug. I want to get more that look like this. This is cute. Oh, there's a fan. I've never seen this one before. <laughs> this it's is a awesome. wind flower fan. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, you nice. Can use a little red lamp at the corner because I'm trying to get more more points. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. I can see that. <laughs> but it still sticks with your like sort of like pink theme throughout the house. Nice. Oh, and then the fish model. Oh, the fish model, yeah. <laughs> and then the katana uh, at the back. This is so cute. Is this from Gulliver? Or? The katana, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, nice. I wish Gulliver was stop bringing trash. What do you get from Gulliver? What have you got? I got a uh, South Pole recently. I got some wigs um, from time to time. Yeah, I, I feel like the wigs are garbage. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really disappointed every time I have never got Really? I'll show you some of the wigs that I've got. <laughs> I have only gotten like furniture. I've been really lucky. Um, so what do we have left? We have the our like forbidden forest on the right and then mm. the yard on the left. So this will be very difficult to navigate, but we'll follow to... you. Right. Um, this is like the one luxury house that we built a little pool. Mmm. Wow. Um, Who is this lucky villager? It's Phil. Phil. Yeah, he's a peacock. <laughs> nice. Is his house interesting? Um, it looks pretty nice on the inside. It's all black. So my two favorite houses are Phil and, um, there's the new here. Um, not the uh, Logan. Lo Lo Lopez. Lopez. Okay. Mm. Oh, yeah. It's very well themed. Everything is black. Whoa! Crafting. Get what he's crafting. I want to get what he's crafting. What's he making? A decoy duck. Oh, cute. Yeah, I, I really like the house. Yeah. I want that bathroom. 
Yeah. <laughs> Bye, Phil. Bye. He feels like a, he's like a mature gentleman mm -hmm. who uh, who likes to live the good life. <laughs> Go into the forbidden forest. Mm. Got a little bit of a pansy situation going on here. It's really annoying when our fossils are in here because you can't see them. Oh. Um, <laughs> have we collected all the fossils yet? Yeah, we're done with the fossils. Nice. Got this little hidden spot. <laughs> <laughs> This is where I go to wind down away from Alex. <laughs> nice. This is where you go hide from Alec. Yeah. It's also <laughs> tree storage, so we put all of our extra trees here. <laughs> nice. It's like a fruit reserve. Yeah. Wow. What do you think of the Forbidden Forest? Should we keep it or dig it up? Um, I, I don't mind keeping it, but I want to replace almost every tree with fruit trees so I don't have to shake so many to find the, uh, from each other. Oh, okay. Now, Alec is really into shaking all the trees for furniture. Mm. Over here, there's more, like, space where I was breeding flowers and haven't cleaned it up yet. Mm. And then we got a little bonus apple orchard. Nice. Mm -hmm. That's inspired by the one time you went to an apple orchard up north. Yep. No, it was <laughs> the first time I went to an apple mystery island and I got really excited and dug up a bunch of apple trees. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, they, they're still here. Yeah, so our native uh, fruit is pear. And, yeah. But we've dug up so many other trees that you can't really yeah. tell. Oh, cute little red um, lighthouse tree. Yeah, I've got a lighthouse down there. So up on the tallest cliff, we've got a graveyard. Ooh. One of these is Pietro, who was uh, our first camp camper. Pietro was like the mm. rainbow sheep thing. Right. Or the clown sheep. Clown sheep. And yeah. I uh, bullied him out of the town. Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't like him. All so right. <laughs> Pay some respect. Yeah. <laughs> you got like a nice vantage point over Brooklyn. Uh, yeah. Nice. Like the, I like how they call this the Western Stone. It's oh, like, yeah. <laughs> what does this mean? Oh, okay. <laughs> I think that's a full island. Yeah, that's pretty much our full island tour. I don't think there's anything else. You saw the lighthouse? Mmm. Yes. Well, now we can like walk around and I'll ask some more general questions for you too. Does that sound good? Sure. Okay. All right. So you mentioned like Alec is really into shaking trees for furniture. Is, it, <laughs> is this your favorite activity to do? Is there any other top activities you like doing in the game? I, I think I'm more into fishing than you, just because I have caught I think <laughs> all of them and you have not. Yeah. Uh, I think I'm, so I'm, I'm more into fishing and she's more into the flowering. I'm more so. into flower breeding mm. and then talking to villagers. I talk, I try to talk to every villager every day. Nice. I, uh, I, I don't think I've even wanted enough flowers to merit the first badge. <laughs> <laughs> what about the least favorites? What do you enjoy the least? Yeah. I don't like terraforming. Alec did almost all of the terraforming except for mm. this little bit that I did for my house. <laughs> even I, think I had to do the setup for him. <laughs> you set it up, but then I made it more grandiose. <laughs> That's nice. How, but you, so you both uh, live on this island. Who is the primary player? I'm the primary resident. Oh, you are the primary resident? It was really annoying at the beginning when we had to pay for a lot of infrastructure and I had to spend all of my money on the infrastructure. But how do you, so do you have the same vision for this island? Do you have this agreement on what to do? 
from time to time. <laughs> well, Alec doesn't agree with my flower breeding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I, I kind of guess I'm going to develop this part of the island, then I develop it, and then she has to move her flowers, <laughs> and we just do that for a while. <laughs> do you have planning meetings? Yeah, we do sometimes. <laughs> I don't think there's a lot of like sketching stuff about it initially. Yeah, I mean, oh. we used to talk about the plan for our island a lot. I don't talk about it as much anymore. <gasps> nice. Um, when you were developing the island, did you kind of start with a vision in mind, or do you kind of organically say, "Oh, this piece, I can like do this." Like, I mean, we basically it. started with the idea of New York and then have just mm. expanding on it. Yeah, so the, the rivers that we see now are basically the rivers that we started with, mm. more or less. So when we saw that there was like, we would start on an isolated island surrounded by water, Manhattan mm. came to mind. Mm. That makes sense, That's the Hudson River. Right, mm. the rest developed from that, I think. Nice. Um, what about inspiration? Where do you go to get inspiration for decorating? You have been on, we both read like the Animal Crossing subreddit a bit. Mm. A lot of this is like stuff we just came up with. Yeah, I don't, I, outside like, of like, I steal all the art for the panels because I don't want to. Yeah. Mm. But other than that, I think uh, most of it's just, oh, we should do this. And then acting on it. Mm. I guess we can go to the beach. We've got like a couple of beach stands. Here we have the protein shack. Mm. The sandal shack. And the, what is this? T-shirt? Hawaiian t-shirt shack. <laughs> nice. It's very summery. So, you can... Oh, then there's something at the back. Is it a protein shake? Yeah, that's the... Uh, <laughs> nice. Um, which island do you visit the most outside of your own? I don't know. Have you visited an island a lot? I guess I, guess I, vi I visited my brother more than once, so I guess yeah. him. What do you plan to do with your island next? Um, probably the spots that you saw that were underdeveloped, like mm. in Queens on the east side. Mm -hmm. yeah up there. I want to put out more pads and make the flowers more contained so they stop like spreading everywhere. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. Yeah. How much time do you spend digging up flowers and, <laughs> um, in your town? Because I feel like I spend 10 minutes a day digging up flowers that are in the wrong place. Yeah, I had to do one massive uh, move oh. to kind of plan out. So I have like the display area and then the breeding area and then a growing area. So like after I breed something, I would like want to multiply them. And then after I did that one massive move, migration, it got a lot easier um, to, to maintain. My project is to <laughs> our flower overgrowth situation. <laughs> Yeah, flowers, yeah, I was like this game, like, I just spent so much time moving things around. Um, uh, would you do anything differently if you're starting from scratch? Um, let me think. Would we have done more terraforming? Because it's pretty hard to terraform now that we... Well, you want, I asked and you said you wanted a natural. I think I would have saved up for like better, I think we would have planned bridges and ramps a lot better. Yeah, I mean we can still build more. Mm. So like, more like the infra um, part. Uh, yeah, I think more infrastructure stuff. Nice. Wow. Awesome! Thanks for showing me around. Do you think we regret naming our island Cinnabar and then doing nothing to do with that? <laughs> oh, no, no, I have a plan for that, don't you worry. Okay. Ooh, that's exciting. I got uh, the magma wallpaper and magma flooring. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't know what to do with it yet. That's awesome. Well, I'm looking forward to um, seeing all the new developments and see what you do to <laughs> echo the Cinnabar theme. <laughs>